Robbie, back at home on Saturday, welcome Northampton to the Crown Hall Arena. Is it all about sort of building on the last three unbeaten and the, the last six, seven games that we've been on so far? Yeah, I think um, in terms of results, we've been very close to getting better results. We understand we didn't play very well on Tuesday night, but we managed to scramble a draw out of it. So I think you've got to sometimes take the positive out of that aspect just, just on its own merit because I've sat here plenty of times this season and been really pleased with the performance but disappointed with the result. It sort of switches a little bit for me for, for Tuesday. Um, so I think there's a, a doggedness about our performances at the minute that says that even when we're not playing well, we're going to stick in and we're going to defend. We're, we're going to try and the goalkeeper make a couple of saves to keep us in the game. Then we were due a chance and thankfully we, we got our one and only chance but we scored it. Now. I've sat here plenty of times before and said we've got the highest XG in the league and everything. So it's just swung around a little bit and our main focus now is to, to port, perform well. Um, and if we perform well, then I believe we can win the game. You've heard it a lot before for teams that are doing well sort of at the top of the league that when they don't perform so well, they, they manage to get a result. Has that kind of been the case, I guess, in especially on Tuesday night, but as well the first half on Saturday and the games previous to that? Uh, I mean, a little bit. But we're not at the top of the league, so um, we, we would obviously like to win the games and that's always the main focus going into it and I try and pick a team that, that will do that. Now when I do pick that team it's up to the players to perform the game plan and perform technically well and we were just off it on Tuesday um, and we've had a lot of criticism I'm sure on the back of that but we drew the game against a good team. So we can sort of dissect it as much as we want. We go against a team that's flying high at the top of the table on, on Saturday. They're doing well. They've changed the team from when we beat them earlier in the season. And we know we, need, we will need to perform better to get a result, and that's our main focus. Is it exciting from your point of view that we've got those levels to aspire to that we've shown already this season that we can improve the performance? From yeah, because when we're good, we're good. Um, like I say, second half at Scunthorpe, I thought we were very good. Spells against the top of the table at Forest Green, we were very good. And probably didn't get the results that we should have. We got results that we shouldn't have on Tuesday. So we go into every game thinking we can play well and if we play well it gives us a chance in it. You just spoke about the opposition there. What are your thoughts on Northampton because they're the second in the league at the moment? Yeah, they've been on a really strong run defensively, very, very sound. Um, like I said, we beat them away from home earlier in the season but there's been a, a lot of personnel changes for both teams. So it'll be another strong, strong challenge for us. Um, we hope to, to play our football a little bit more than we, we did. And if we do, then we'll give them problems, vice versa. We need to make sure that we, we defend as well as we possibly can, tidy up in certain aspects of our game. Um, and like I say, if we do that, it gives us a, a real good possibility to pick three points up. How's the squad looking after Tuesday night's game? Um, yeah, pretty similar, to be honest. Obviously, um, Jimmy Keyan came back onto the bench, so he's had an extra couple of days training. Um, there was a couple of boys that played the game on Tuesday who were ill, um, so hopefully now 48, well, I say ill. There was an illness kicking around the squad that we've had for a, a week or so, so hopefully they're sort of more recovered on the back of that now with an extra couple of days. And yeah, we, we're going to be really positive, try and be positive with the players, try and be positive on the pitch, and hopefully that positivity can sort of filter into the stands and we, we have a really good day Saturday. With not, I guess, only a couple of injuries now, we long to Paul Down and Josh Andrews. You've got a lot of options in, in the squad to choose from as well. Definitely. So the players that are in the team know there's somebody willing to come in and, and take the place. Um, you know, I, I always pick a team on who I think can can win that game, but it'll take everybody. You've seen the impact that the substitutes have had in recent weeks, and that's that's really strong. We've got a, a crazy busy schedule coming up, um, and like I say, everyone needs to be ready for when they're called upon to produce on the pitch.